Hey, what's up, YouTube? Please comment, rate, subscribe. This video is for people who want to use RAM disk and they have Windows XP. Now, if you want to use RAM disk for Minecraft, yeah. Okay. First off, I already have your volume set up. Okay. After you've already had it set up, make sure you put the minecraft.exe into the volume. Nothing else, just minecraft.exe into this volume. Now, after you've done that, open up Notepad and then put two phrases in the Notepad. These two phrases are what I'm showing on the screen. I don't feel like reading it. <laughs> I'll leave you here for like two seconds. You guys can pause the video if you need it still. Okay, I'll also put it into the video, uh, into the info, the more information. Okay. Now, after that, say click file and then save as. Now when you save it, change it from .txt to .cmd or .bat. You can name it whatever you want, just make sure you have the ending .cmd or .bat .bat or cmd Okay, after you've done that put it into your volume right here and then you run it and then uh, after you run it you should get this folder then whatever saves you have that are in percent app data whatever saves you have in here just drag it into this folder into these saves see how I drag it in there okay and then then go back and run it after you run it this should pop up log in load your world or whatever okay and to show that this works sorry I have to find the F3 key alright here we are okay to show it works look at the FPS 43 the 44 pretty good I'm gonna move around a little bit to show you guys mm -hmm. sorry I have to hold the phone and or I mean the video camera and play this is kinda hard Yeah, as you can tell, I'm using one hand. Whee! Look at that, and then I'm in an area underground, and then it starts going up when I, once I get out of underground. Oh, wait, uh... Jeez. Now look, see as I'm out of here, it starts skyrocketing. 57, 55, 60, 62, 66. Yeah, so, I mean, this works. And I'll just go hacking at the ground to show you that even though you're going, it's still pretty high. See? And now, what you can do is, to make it even better, just go to video settings, options, uh, video setting, I gotta, um, go to graphics, make it fast, smooth lighting off, GUI scale normal, if, uh, view bobbing off, max FPS for performance, 
and render distance short or tiny. I like short because then it still loads, but tiny's better if you want it faster. Because I'll make it tiny and I'll show you. But I think at 30 it's pretty good. See, look at it, it's already going up. 66. Now when I make it far, it goes down. Not by much though. Well, yeah, by much. And this is how it is at normal. And at tiny, it's the best. But I like it at short. Okay, that's the video for you.